My name is Nadim. I'm from Egypt. I'm a 23-year-old graduate architect from the Canadian University. I decided to study architecture because I come from a family of mostly architects and engineers. Like my father is an architect, my brother graduated from architecture. From high school, I knew that this was the path that I was going to. I had some doubts at first, but at the end, I knew that this was what I wanted to do. My graduation project is a museum of science located in Al Wasl area in Dubai. It's a 20,000 square meter project. It focuses mostly on the Arabic contribution to the science community. So the process of design that I started working with was the first thing I, what I needed to do was my research. I needed to know what a museum is before I could design and I needed to know what makes a museum a successful museum. At first I started researching different museums, different spaces, like what kind of requirements does an exhibition space need? If I'm gonna have an auditorium, what kind of requirements does an auditorium need? After that part, I started looking at different architectural styles to figure out what kind of approach would fit most an Arabic museum of science at that. And at the end of the day, I went through a kind of organic approach. I come from an Arabic background and I come from an Islamic background. And from an early age, I was always interested in science. Looking at the thing now, I don't think many people notice or know the contribution that the Arabic community actually has towards the science. The best thing I could say about my architectural education was the studio culture, more or less. A lot in the work was sometimes tedious. But at the end of the day, seeing the final product and hearing a positive feedback from all of my instructors and my peers would make everything that happened extremely worth it at the end. Well, now I've graduated, I've finished my graduation, and I have my bachelor's degree from architecture. What I wanted to do was to continue with my postgraduate studies. So as of now, I've already started applying in many universities to get my master's degree. And hopefully after that, I will continue even further with my PhD. My end goal is to be an instructor at a prestigious university.